Cloud computing is starting to have an impact on the way businesses deploy and use software. We're talking to collaboration specialist Matt Patton of IBM. Matt, for those who still aren't sure, what exactly is cloud computing? Well, cloud computing is a means of delivering computer services. Uh, where the underlying technology and infrastructure is almost invisible to an organization. So traditionally, organizations have got large uh, departments who are running their infrastructure, running their servers, running um, their bandwidths and their networking. But now with cloud computing, all of that infrastructure is actually outsourced into a data center. I believe one of the key benefits of cloud computing is the ability to work from anywhere now, like this cafe for instance. That's absolutely right. You know, one of the beauties of cloud computing is that you can now have access to your customers, to your business partners, uh, and to your organization from anywhere. With a secure internet access, I can access my organization from anywhere. So what are most organizations looking for when it comes to cloud computing? Organizations are looking for different things depending on role. So the CEO, as a good example, is looking to gain a competitive advantage through innovation. The CFO is looking for profitability and growth, but visibility into what IT the organization is running. And the CIO is looking for a reliable system, but also looking for early user adoption for these technologies. From a collaborations perspective, then what trends are you seeing? It's interesting because in the consumer space, we're seeing a lot of technologies now being used Technologies like LinkedIn and MySpace and Facebook. Now these social software technologies are playing a really big part now in the enterprise space. What that's allowing businesses to do is to find people within their organizations and also externally to collaborate with and meet their business objectives. IBM's Lotus has released a range of award-winning online tools. What does the Lotus Life portfolio now allow you to do? Well, the Lotus Live portfolio is split into three different areas. The first is messaging, so that's purely email, calendaring and contacts. The second is collaboration and the third is web conferencing. What we can see here is the Lotus Live homepage. Now this, as we talked about earlier, gives everybody all the information they need about what Lotus Live is, what the capabilities are, plus 30-day free trial, which allows people to actually test the software itself. So let's actually go and have a look at exactly what Lotus Live is and what it does. So here you can see my Lotus Live dashboard. As you can see, there's my picture with my name and my role and responsibility within the organization. Plus on the left hand side, you can see the index. Here you can see Lotus Live meetings. This gives me the ability to manage, set up and host a web conference. Next you can see events. This gives me the ability to create and manage webinars. So my network allows me to find people inside or outside my organization depending on their role or their expertise. So very much a look up and find the right person to do business with. Next there's files. So files allows us to collaborate around documents. So I can now not only store files within Lotus Live, but I can also send and share content through these documents and files with other people inside and outside my organization. Here we have activities that allows the entire team to stay in touch throughout a project. Forms and charts allows me to go out and create surveys and also to provide information in different charts and different formats. Then there's instant messaging. Instant messaging is key to a unified user communications experience. What are the key benefits of adopting collaboration in the cloud and how does Lotus Live enable you to do it? Well firstly it's important to realize and remember that IBM has been hosting for 40 to 50 years so we certainly have the experience. The other benefits and the other key differentiators for Lotus Live is security. It's built on business grade security. Obviously the cost is very low and with Lotus Live it's subscription licensing. So it's per user per month. Flexibility is key as well. So organizations can now pick and choose 
exactly what technologies, what collaborative technologies they're, they're after. They can also leverage these new collaborative technologies such as social software and they can do it today. They don't need to wait. It's all there in the cloud, ready to access right now. What should someone do if they're interested in finding out more about these technologies? Well, certainly lotuslive.com uh, is the first port of call. I'd encourage anybody to go and look and find out a little bit more about Lotus Live. Also, there's a 30-day free trial. So organizations, whether it's email, whether it's the collaboration tools we've talked about, or whether it's web conferencing, can have 30 days to actually try this technologies and see how it's going to benefit their business.